Hello, my spies. Welcome back to the Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door. Last time, well, we have a goal, but we also are here just to finish up the Blitz Pit again. I might be able to just use Flurry Gale Force to be able to just cheese it. I don't remember what Crawdaddy is. Oh, it's that one. 
They can use hammer, but I'm not allowed to. <laughs> I'm not allowed to use my hand no one can use Perfect. For now, we're not getting more. Okay, Jump country.
going to be kind of useful. That's fine. Earn the challenge room ourselves. We heal up. No, not trying to jump on the bed. <laughs> Mathematically involved by the right, so that definitely does not have mm -hmm. two ton bags and five ton hammers. This time we're not gonna get cheated out of a fight. This time Hawk's actually coming in. Now for today's main event, after coming back to take the Major League Stop Rank, the Great Gonzales will finally challenge the champion Rocka. First big winner, we have the Golden Grandstander, Rocka. You go champ, Rocky! You go champ, you go champ! Another champ, tell us about the price of the Petro Day Challenger is the Great Gonzales the only man to ever wrestle the battle week. <laughs> That's it. All ancient history, there's only one true champ, and that guy is Rocky. <laughs> one of us is walking out here with Bill, but the other is gonna get rocked. It's getting rocked. But champ, it's always showed no signs of rust when you climb back up the ranks. Shatter his own record, why not remember? That's right, you. <laughs> hey, show your trap or this Gonzalez is going to be the only one feeling the rock. <laughs> and the champ, and the story, I'm a legend. This legend is about to rock that dude. I love how he's actually playing into that. Big words from the champ, and now the challenger is his own introduction the former champion the champ returns to the Superstar sequel, The Great Gonzalez. Gonzalez, 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 Gonzalez. <laughs> no way, going about the time match is so awesome. This rules. Let's do this. You brought me, Gonzalez, he's back. You got you a man. This is the Rocko for the Brave Challenger of the Great Gonzales. Been a while since this champion. But who will emerge victorious this time? The battle is ready. Ring the bell. Get ready to brawl. Ten 
take that champ back from here to Rob. Alright, Gonzalez, we're fighting the champ. I'm so fired up. <laughs> Time for you to meet me and Brood Rock. Yeah. You have a horror of a world class rocking. Yeah, yeah, I'm a little ashamed. Come out of the park. Oh, I didn't even need to break down. No, oh, don't believe it's fine. Am I actually getting rocked again? Who could have seen this coming? You could have planned a more ferocious battle. What well, ferocious? One well, moves raw power, flying fist fury. What a beautiful destruction. This, well, that would inaugurate definitely, absolutely, completely, extreme, extreme battle of very highest caliber. There was only one winner, and this time it was the Grey Gonzalez. Congratulations, Gonzalez. Once again, you're a champion. Have his fight, but actually make him tougher. And of course, we've got our bed. The bed that is very special and heals up our star power too. And we can actually check out all the exhibition matches we can have now. Ralkan, Kukunir, Trump Country, Hannah Bound Player, Car Daddy. Well, they actually got new. That's actually nice. Some of them actually have some things. However, we do have something we have to do. Let's We actually have two fans now. Which I really like. I really like the way they did this. Because I don't believe in the original they did this. So jump down from the crowd. Back. 
trouble center. Mega Rush is going to be kind of useful, so you might want to get this right now. Jumpman, I'm not a fan of, personally. I like having options. But also the fact that some of my hammer badges are going to be quite useful. Just something... Fire drive, we've got another fire drive. Uh, damage dodge is actually going to be quite good, but not right now. Uh, we might want two simplifiers. Not right now. I don't remember if simplifiers. I think simplifiers actually do make the uh, super guard easier. We will want both of these for now. Not right, but we won't be really using it. Uh, no. I'm selling, that's what I want to do. Sell the effects badges. Trying to place some of these. Um, defense plus. Yes, and yes, I am selling these badges for these for good reasons. Fire drive, quick hammer, quick hammer. will have one use, if only really one. I don't remember... Might want another fire drive, because attacking it does make things easier. We're not getting first attacks ever, but it's first attacks not really useful. Power jump's pretty much useless now. This goal will actually be kind of useful. Plus, these two damage dodges are the one we really want. As well. Everything else, yeah, it's fine. I've seen so many things say different things. Okay. So there's a chance that I'm actually keeping the game closed. Excellent time. If only have it, Mario! I found a way to get you to the moon! You must go far out of it. You must use the cannon then, it will blast you! Using a cannon to get to the moon? Wherever you sit, down. I know it sounds really, to be honest, I'm not entirely sure what it is. from far off, I'll speak of a device that can launch anything anywhere! Even to the moon! Well, where is this far off, Professor? I believe there's a pipe some far, far off or somewhere within the equipment. But I'm not sure of the exact location. I believe it was hidden for some reason. My 
Okay, great. You'll need something called the Ultra Hammer to get it. Ultra Hammer? That's me. You already got one of those. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, I see. Well, that certainly changed the subject now, doesn't it? <laughs> well, usually I'm just fine to type far off than get to it. The problem, obviously, with far off us is... Oh, yes. One more thing you should be aware of. The bombs will never hurt. Sorry, sir. They may not let you use their can cannon for me. In case, that's your problem. Good luck. Get the last one. I also just realized I forgot to save a, save a bit of money, so I'm going to go sell stuff. Give me a moment, because I'm apparently a genius at planning this out. Maybe because I realized I needed some of these badges early, but I also forgot I need money to pay Merlee. Here to sell. Jelly Ultra. Uh, Zest special. Oh, I don't want to get rid of them. half my stuff. It's actually quite good. Uh, first, I actually store the Jelly Ultra before I forget. Uh, Ultra. That special's still pretty good. Problem. <laughs> right, I could sell. Actually, I could just sell one of the bushies. Nope. I'm not really needing them that much now. I still need them, but not as much. And this is just mainly for Marley's curse, because apparently, like, I swear, the curse is not even lost. At all in a while, so I think I might have to beat him, which sucks for the fans. But we leave Merlys aside. No way, I can't get it. Cast a spell. Special pack. I swear in the original it would tell you if it faded, and if it did tell me it faded. I didn't notice. But that's on me. And heck, I'm, I'm fine with you guys actually telling me in the comments if it, if it did say it faded. And I did not notice, because god, I, that would tell me. Especially if you can find the exact episode that actually faded. Still pretty good, that's still actually pretty good. We will be needing some defense pluses stuff.
this house, I believe. As well as get the shine spray, I believe. Let's first see this house. Do I remember? I do not remember this house. Alright, because it just has this. Now we're going to get one of the badges I want to get from Dazzle. Good. As well as also upgrade another part part member, which I might upgrade Cocoon's as well. Can I be invaluable for the pit? Because if I'm remembering correctly, um, who is the most valuable? Technically, Flory is the most valuable, but she has what she needs for the pit to make it easy. Showstopper eventually, but well, I got another fire flower. Not what I was wanting, but hey. Hey there, Dazzle. Gel is also going to be pretty useful. Actually, wait. Uh, pretty lucky. Okay, pretty lucky will also be kind of useful. Oh, right. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna get pretty lucky right now. I was gonna get the. I was gonna get one of these two. Oh. Decreasing partner FP is gonna be kind of. Fun. Kind of useful though, so I'll make it. I'll make it easier for us to use certain certain things. Okay, some badges. Quit pretty lucky. I mean, I could. Put on uh, fire drive, but hey. Now let's keep going. Investment did come back. Nine hundred ninety-nine coins. That was actually 
Very worth it. Yeah, you guys can read if you want. Also, buzzer! Buzzer reference. Yeah, I probably should have went to him first. I go off. But anyway, that means I can save with money for any more expensive stuff. Man, I can just get rid of. You know what? I'm gonna get rid of both these from his inventory. At least doesn't start continuously stalking them. So I believe you can only stalk one of each of those. As long as you don't sell them. Uh, our face will be kinda useful, but I'm not going to use them. And. Uh, we can spend some of the money here. Refund is actually gonna be can can actually be kinda useful. But in the first of these, uh yeah, I'm gonna do Some cake, but also I believe I actually got fun enough to actually have items to make certain special items. Let's first do one one cake mix. items. I believe we use a cake mix and fire flower. I believe we do also get some white sure also fire pop. Use two items. Give me anything, but... Yes, it did. An electro pop. I want to try one more to think. A whack a bomb also gets us something, which is part of the reason why I didn't put the whack a bomb back here. Okay, no, it did not. That was a waste of whack a bomb. And okay. But that's fine, that's fine. We can just get more later. And by later, I mean pretty much right now. Because we still have some more to spend. By, by more, I mean we can buy two more. I'll trade in my winnings. Cake mix does make a really good item. I don't remember which one it is. Okay, we also need to Okay, good. We didn't actually get past like pop. I 
pulled that from Dazzle. Sheesh. Granted, it'll be kind of, it'll still be useful. Now we finally are in Chapter 7, Mario Shoots the Moon! He's escaping to the one place that's not corrupted by capitalism. Oh no. It's a stupid cold out here. Come on, Gonzalez, let's move. Fire up should be up ahead, I think. Nice ride. That was so fast. Star piece.
Why do I keep getting the Wii? Double twenty to forty would have just been perfect. AP plus P, which is really not that useful, honestly. Still got its uses, though. So this is how it happens. Where do you think they keep the account players? Well, I'm going to find out. Let's start talking about mm. some of the villagers. Let's bring up Bobbery. He's with his own kid. We heard the chili hunter is the traveling sister's free. He came to fire up the ski and ice skate. There's nothing here. It's cold. It's too cold. I told you we should at least check the guidebook before we came here. Back to 
Oh yeah, this is perfect by shooting stars. Uh Yes, the rest of the shooting stars are going to be used on the pair behind the trials. So... Yeah, I forgot that they sold them here. Because they're not usually an item that's sold in a lot of the games, so... And I forgot to actually power a partner. I'll do that because we'll eventually have to do really go back. Yes, what business do you have here? What? A piano? No, it's a finger. Now listen, listen here. You're the mayor, hmm? How can a fisher like you lie out of the way? Oh boy, I know I saw a cannon. I saw a cannon the last time I was here. So do not lie, sir. Shush! You call yourself a bob -ob. I spit it. You know rules. There is to be no mention of cannon to non bob -obs. No mention. We must not allow things to be used for evil. Of course I know all that, you great blowhard. But well, we must use that cannon to get to the moon all the way. Even if we don't, sir, the world could end. Oh, world could end. Well, we cannot have that. Still, we cannot use cannon. Right now, because of certain circumstances. Circumstances? We must have permission of Gold Bob to use cannon. He is the one who started the whole blasting things to far away places policy. Once he was rich, he let business slide and does not start it up again. Also, General White was the one who devoted himself to operation of cannon. But he was so depressed by losing a job that he took cannon key and ran off to set himself in far, far away. Gold Bob and General White. Yes, that is correct. If you want to use cannon, you must find gold bar in general. Very well then, we can't give up now, old boy. Mario, the search is on, let's go find these two bar -bombs. Well, once you find them, come back and talk to me. And meet the other part of the game no one's a fan of! Also known as Backtracking 2.0. Or, also known as, the General Y Quest. Also, if you want to go for 100% in this game, you have to, you have to go searching the whole, the whole map twice. For General Gundam Y. I would not run away, but no, I'm not getting this. There we go. Uh, 
I will be doing the whole general white part of this goddamn that backtracking quest next time. But I will do the gold bomb part. Also, allows me to actually first check this guy. Yes, I'm going to check him every time. Uh. Fine, Rachel, you have one use. Maybe not. Open here. Coops, before I forget. Shazibi, Shazubi. The final one will be Miss Mouse, because Miss Mouse literally has some of the worst abilities. I'm sorry. Good day to you, Gonzales. What can I do for you today? What did you say? You must use the cannon to power our force to save the world? That is a rather... That is rather a pickle, isn't it? Very well then, I certainly owe you a favor to guess I should say. I would bet I hope to resume my business with that cannon someday. Well, it takes a heavy bit of coin to get the cannon, so I'll need you to demonstrate just how much you want to use that cannon. If it were all a matter of money, just how much would you pay, my ask? Everything I have! What? You'd, you'd pay every coin you owe? All of them? You, really? So, really? Well, I suppose I'm just surprised to hear you say that. Staggered, really, actually. You know that means you'll be left with zero coins with absolutely nothing. You know that, do you? Yes. I mean, think of it, man. If you spent all your coins, and I mean all of them, you would certainly face a great deal quickly down the road. Yes, I know. Hold on. Are you sure you're fully doing this fully aware of the consequences? Are you sure you won't regret this later? Absolutely sure. Yes! Well, just say, just kidding later on, or any sort of tomfoolery like that. Really took them all? Really? Yes! But well, alright then. I don't care. I spent all I need to spend for a while. You've certainly shown me something, sir. So, can I give you permission for, for you to activate our Apple's cannon? Go buzz pass. Oh, and I wasn't supposed to take earlier, my dear fellow. Oh, great, take your money. Ah, it's a shame, I suppose. But I'll return your money. Now, so is your own. And... Alright. Alright. Before I sign off, before I sign off, 
Back here, I'm going to tell you how this will work. General White Quest will literally have you go back to Pelipper, to Bogley Woods, to Glitzville, to Keel Hall Key, to... What's the place called again? I should just check. Oh, that's that Keel Hall Key. So what's... Twilight Town! Twilight Town, then Keel Hall Key then Poshley Heights, and then back to Port Outpost. You have to talk to a specific NPC. This is why no one likes the General Y quest. But, I'll be doing that next time, because I don't want to deal with that. <laughs> I will eventually have to, but hey, that's for me to deal with later. So, my lovely sparks, I'll see you guys then. Oh, see you guys in my second. Good, I'm yawning so much.